everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a birthday vlog. This vlog basically is gonna be everything revolving around my birthday. And this kind of vlog started yesterday when I had my hair done. So as you can see, this is what it looks like now. I'm back, I'm back a dark queen and I love it. So this vlog is gonna have kind of like three sections. So it's gonna be the prep for my birthday, which was my hair. And I'm gonna be getting my nails done and like the shower, everything prepping for my birthday and then it's going to be my actual birthday weekend so my plans and then I'll show you what I got for my birthday as well. It's currently the 11th of September and my birthday is the 18th of September. I obviously got my hair done yesterday and then I'm going to get my nails done on Friday and then on the 17th the plans kind of start and I'm going to my sister's for my birthday breakfast then I'm seeing a friend and then that Saturday evening, that Saturday night, I'm going out, out with my friends. That's like kind of the main birthday event. And then on my actual birthday on the Sunday, I'm going to Yo Sushi with my sister for lunch, which will be really nice. And then I'm going to my grandparents' house in the evening. And then the Monday, my sister has told me to have the Monday free for whatever she's got planned for my birthday. So I don't really know what it is yet, but that's going to be happening on the Monday, some sort of birthday plan on the Monday. And then I'll show you what I get for my birthday, which is, like I mentioned before, probably going to be my new camera for YouTube. So I'm really excited for that. I hate doing videos. Like, I hate watching videos where people are like, this is what I got for my birthday, because it always seems really braggy. And I just, they're not the sort of things that I like to watch. So I have debated about putting it in this vlog or not. However, because it's related to YouTube and it's probably gonna be the camera, I think I will show you because I'm just gonna be so excited. Also, as you can probably tell by my voice, I'm currently ill. So I'm praying that this goes by my birthday because it's just not gonna be fun. Like I just have like the worst cold, which I did get off my friend, if you're watching. Thank you. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Please pray for me that I'm okay for my birthday. Hi. Um, I don't like to do clips and stuff of me crying, but it's a birthday vlog and I want to be real and I don't just want to put all of like the fun stuff, the happy stuff when there's sad stuff too. So basically, just a quick update. You know how I said that there was plan for me and my sister on the Monday and that she'd got this whole thing planned. It's a spa day and they've cancelled so that's not happening anymore on the Monday. Obviously completely not my sister's fault at all. We're gonna reschedule. I think it's because of the Queen's death. It's the bank holiday now. That's been cancelled which obviously is fine we'll just do something else but then for my party the going out on the Saturday three people have cancelled so there's only now gonna be me and three other friends um, which we're still gonna have a lovely time but I just wanted to show that like that's not happening anymore or things don't go to plan like I do feel shit about it because often my like intrusive overthinking thought is that I have no friends and that's irrational I do have beautiful friends who I love so much um but it's kind of like triggered my thoughts of that sorry for the sniffling it's just feels a bit shit right now still gonna have the best time but yeah that's an update on the situation I'll still see you Friday to get my nails done I've just got back from work. I'm still so ill. I felt so ill today, which is probably not helping with the emotional side. Are the nails I am in love however I feel like I should have got them without the gems on I feel like I really liked them when he was doing them before he put the gems on and oh my god they were 50 pounds like that's just that's just so much and like one of the gems has already came off when I was getting my card out of my purse um so that's a bit annoying but yeah I am in love with them I really uh, hey cookie um I really really like them so Birthday nails are done, and I've just got to show you, so, hey babe. Oh, what is that? Just got to give you a Sainsbury's haul because I did film a clip, but they've got pumpkins in Sainsbury's, and obviously I had to get them. Look, this was called a ghost munchkin pumpkin. 
I've never, I never knew that that's what they were called. So I got him and then I got this little, this little baby orange one. I love them. This is just a munchkin pumpkin. I have had these ones before, so I'm going to decorate them because I got this teddy pumpkin and if you can't tell, autumn is my favourite time. It's just made me so happy. I had a gingerbread hot chocolate from Costa and like I've got pumpkins, like it just feels so <laughs> autumn-y. Um, so I don't really know where to put these. I think maybe on my windowsill somewhere. Pumpkins just make me happy and autumn makes me happy and this is just, this is just making my depression go away. Just this right here. So I had a really nice morning, got my nails done obviously, which they're growing on me, they're growing on me. And then I got myself a gingerbread hot chocolate, like I said, which is just the favorite, favorite thing. Sorry, I look really windswept. Um, I need to wash my hair, so that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna wash my hair for my birthday. What else did I wanna say to you? Oh yeah, I wanted to say that like, basically I find it really hard to go out on my own now. Like I used to be so independent and I just like, I find it quite um, difficult to like walk around on my own now. I don't know why. I just wanted to say that like, I'm quite proud of going and doing all that on my own this morning because it was quite, not like, not scary, but it's a bit anxiety provoking, I guess. But yeah, I had a really nice time and here is your reminder to go and take yourself out on a date. But now the prep starts because I'm gonna wash my hair, shave, tan, all of that jazz, and I'm gonna film my curly hair routine for this week's video. So that will be up by the time you watch this because this is gonna be up the week after. He wants my water. He literally just drinks my water all the time. It's quite, it's quite disgusting, but I don't care. By the way, I'm completely over the the whole drama that I that I filmed. I'm fine about it now. Like honestly, I just know that we're gonna have such a nice time still. And there has been a slight change of plan on the Sunday. So because now not many people are going out, Mum was like, let's try and make the Sunday a bit more special. So we're now going out for a meal instead of going to my grandparents' house on the Sunday. Look, he's literally trying. <laughs> to get to my water. I'll get it for you in a sec, Cookie. What was I saying? Yeah, so we're going out for a meal to Prezzo the Sunday evening now. And then on the Monday, I think we're just gonna take the dogs on a walk and have a really nice chilled day, which sounds amazing, to be honest. Maybe like a movie marathon or something like that. Do I like them? I do like them. I just, I don't know if I regret the gems. She smells disgusting. <laughs> she smells rank. <laughs> Hello everyone, it's Saturday. I'm just getting ready to go out. I don't have that much time. I am in a little bit of a rush. I really wanted to put my hair up in a ponytail. This is, this is my problem. I really wanted to wear my pony, but it then means that my hair is gonna like look really bad for tomorrow. So I think what I'm gonna do is gonna put it half up, half down, and then hopefully, it looks okay, however, if it doesn't, then I'll just change it. But I'm gonna see how it looks half up, half down first. I don't know. To be fair, this does look all right. I just, shit, I need to put mascara on my lashes. Do you like my lashes? I don't know if you can see them. Yeah, so as you saw earlier, I was able to open my docks because basically I wanted to wear them out tonight because I always wear my docks, but like my old ones are a size five and so they really hurt. So I opened my new ones and I love them so much. And then my friend is taking me to go see the girls' bathroom. I'm, <laughs> I actually can't believe it. Like I'm just so excited. I got some sunflowers, which are my favorite, favorite flower. Um, but yeah, this is my makeup and I got these lashes from um, TK Maxx today. They're quite, they're quite extra, but I thought if I can't go extra tonight, then when can I? This is my outfit, it is a two-piece like suit. 
it's like shorts at the back but then it looks like a skirt at the front basically and it was from Primark and then I've just got this little black top on from Zara and I'm gonna wear it with this pink bag a little pink bag with some pink lace-up heels however I'm then gonna get changed into my docks with a black bag because I'm not wearing heels out but I'm just <laughs> I'm wearing the pink bag and heels for now just whilst I'm here these are my heels which just like lace up and they match they match my bag pretty well but then I'm gonna change it into my black one which was from Shein this was from Primark these are from Misguided I know pretty well <laughs> I am hungover but I'm not actually that bad um I got in at half past one which is like really early I had the best night last night though um we decided to not go clubbing we basically went to two bars in Leicester we went spoons first just for like some treat cheap drinks and then we went to revolution and then we went to Olivia's in Leicester and it was really, really good. Um, but then we went to McDonald's after that and we'd kind of all just like had enough. It was freezing last night. Had the best time, but like, you know, when you're just then not feeling going clubbing. Um, so yeah, we then just came home and it was a really, really lovely night, but I am feeling it a bit this morning. And now, it's the actual day of my birthday, so it's my birthday today. I'm 21, I'm actually 21 now. I was born at half six in the morning. So that's weird. And I'm just getting ready to go for some sushi with my sister. Yeah, I'm not gonna do my makeup now because look how voice, look how deep my voice is after a night out. Like, <clears throat> it hurts. What was I saying? Yeah, I'm not putting like makeup on now because going for sushi and then later on going for a meal um, in the evening with all my family and my grandparents and I want to do my makeup for then and also I really can't be bothered right now so I'm just gonna do my eyebrows and that be it because it's only me and my sister going for lunch anyway and yeah I'm kind of glad this morning that we didn't go to Marsh like we didn't go clubbing because if we had of like I would have been back like probably two hours at least later and it's meant that this morning like I feel bad but I don't feel sick or like really bad and I still fancy my sushi. <laughs> plan for today is sushi and we're going to Leamington for that because that's where Yo Sushi is, it's the nearest one to me. Then I'm going back to my sister's house and my mum and dad are going to join us over there for my presents and I'll open them and then then probably just gonna chill with my sister until the meal for this evening. Actually, before I go, there was a girl wearing my exact outfit last night. <laughs> the um, green suit I had on, it was from Primark, and there was a girl sat behind me in spoons with the exact same one on, and she looked so much better in it, but it's okay. I did smile at her and was like trying to make it into a funny thing, but she didn't look at me. I think she went the other strategy of just avoiding. <laughs> um, but it was funny, she looked great and it's a great outfit so I don't blame her.
biscoff it's and biscoff white chocolate. and white chocolate. <gasps> Shit. Hello everyone, um, I had such a lovely birthday yesterday, today is Monday and it was just such a lovely, lovely day, like I was so emotional in the evening because I just feel like so many people who like I didn't expect to receive a message from, I often feel like I don't have a lot of people around me and people that care and I just felt so grateful to have such lovely people in my life and people that genuinely wanted to send me a lovely message and so many messages like made me cry like from my friends and it it was just so lovely so I just want to say that if any of you sent me a message like I'm so so grateful because you don't know how much it means to me like it's not just a happy birthday message to me it it means so much that like people have actually thought of me and gone to the effort of sending me a message or putting a picture on like social media like just just yeah thank you I feel so lucky to have such lovely people around me and I'm just emotional that for once I actually felt like I have people and that people do actually care it was just yeah it was really really special and my sister made it so special with all of like the cake and the balloons and the, the breakfast that we had the other day, like it was just, people have just gone to so much effort and thought and it's just, yeah, I, I just, I can't thank the people enough because yeah, I actually felt loved and I know it sounds really cringy and really like, ugh. <laughs> but it, it really, it really means a lot. So yeah, with the cringy sad bit out of the way, I'm now gonna show you everything that I got for my birthday, which like I said before, I don't enjoy watching these bits. So if you don't wanna watch this bit, you don't have to. I just, I want to show you the camera and I just think I might as well show you everything else I've got because it's, I'm like, I'm so excited with it all. Okay, so I'm gonna start with my sister's stuff. So she got me some Van Cleef jewellery. She got me this lovely bracelet and the matching necklace and look how nicely that goes with like the length of the other one. However, it isn't the real Van Cleef because they're like three grand for the necklace and that's just ridiculous. I would never want to own something that expensive. It's That's just such a waste of money. So I'm so glad she didn't do that. So these are, these are still gold. I don't know where she got them off but it was like a it's like a, a thing that creates like designer stuff with the same materials, but it's just not the branded designer, if that makes sense. And I just, I, I, I'm obsessed. I love it so, so much. And when I have like my black ring on, it goes so well and it's just, I love it so, so much. I was so shocked by that. I did not expect that at all. She's absolutely, absolutely spoiled me. It's just ridiculous. And then she also got me a lovely spa day, which we are gonna be going on on the 16th of October. This was what was meant to be today. And then it got canceled because of the Queen's funeral. She also got me some eyelashes. She knows me too well. And she got me a black eyeliner because always wearing the black eyeliner and then she got me a pack of four candles which i think are from sainsbury's home this one smells insane it's peony and blush rose they're lovely and they're just in like a white uh jar is it in a jar i don't know but you know what candles in it's just white which is just so nice and clean and aesthetic my grandparents they got me this beautiful, beautiful ring. I don't know if you can see it, if it's gonna focus, but it is white gold and diamond, and it is so special. Like, it's just stunning. Like, the diamonds are like encased in the um, in the rings. It's like, they're not gonna fall out, if that makes sense. And it's just so special because they got my sister a ring for her 21st as well and they know that they they know that we love our rings so much and 
it's just like gonna be something that I can keep forever from them. I'm just so grateful for such a beautiful, beautiful gift. Like it's, it's stunning. I love it so much and it fits perfectly on this finger. I haven't got all my other rings on, but um, yeah, it does look really nice with them all. And then my auntie, she knows I love, well, I used to love and I do still love the MAC Velvet Teddy lipstick. And so she got me this bundle where you get a lip liner as well. This is in the shade Boldly Bare. And I've always wanted a MAC lip liner. I've never, ever had one. And yeah, it's, it's the perfect, perfect shade. So yeah, I got this from my auntie. And then from my parents, I got this teddy because basically I saw them all in TK Maxx and I absolutely, I fucking love teddies. I'm not ashamed to admit it. I love them and I saw them all in TK Maxx and I just love them so much. Like they're such a squishy and soft teddy and I just love them and I love pugs. I was not expecting this at all. This was like the best thing. <laughs> it was so lovely. And there you're waiting for it. I got my camera. We didn't get a brand new one because it's expensive. Yeah, I got it secondhand, but it is actually brand new. Like she hasn't used it. Um, so it is still in literally like perfect condition. And then it's the vlogging kit. So you get the Gorillapod tripod, which is what like everybody has. And I just, it's gonna be such a great one. Cause I do have a tripod, but it's for my phone and it doesn't fit like a camera on it. So I did need the tripod. So, oh, sorry, I haven't even mentioned, have I mentioned what camera I'm getting? It's the Canon PowerShot G7X Mark II. It's my first camera for YouTube. It's an upgrade from my phone. And I just, I can't wait to see what the quality of my videos is gonna be like with this. So here she is. Isn't she beautiful? <laughs> And it comes with a viewfinder. So you can see yourself in the videos, not like what I'm having to do now and looking at myself in the mirror through my phone. I can actually like see myself. Oh my God, I look like such a vlogger. <laughs> I actually can't take myself seriously. Um, but it's just, it's just, it's beautiful. Like I can't even describe it to you. It feels such like a nice weight and it's just, it's so pretty. I cannot wait to use it. I really am gonna like try and set it up today and try and figure out how to like do all the settings. Like I'm just gonna have to spend hours trying to figure out how to use it to be honest. Um, and then it just comes with the cable and the battery charger and the SD card is in the camera. And I think it's a 16 gigabyte one. Actually no, I think it's 32. Yeah, it's 32 gigabytes. Also from my parents, I got some scrunchies because I wear them all the time and I really wanted some more satin ones because I have loads of like velvet, um, like fluffy ones and they do cause a bit of frizz in my hair. So these are lovely satin ones and yeah, just love a good scrunchie. I literally have them in all the time. Okay, and then also from my parents, I really, really needed or like wanted a really long dressing gown because all the ones that I have are like short, they only come to your waist. So I really wanted like a floor length black dressing gown and I found one. This was from House of Fraser and I'm not gonna be able to get this all in the frame, but you get the gist. It's just got a massive hood and it's just super, 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 super long. Um, and it's so soft, so I can't wait to wear this in the winter. It's gonna be perfect when I'm back at uni because I'm on the first floor, like no, the, the bot, like I'm on the, ground floor, literally by the front door of the house. So it's gonna be really cold. And there's also no carpet in my room. So I need to get a rug. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be really cold in the winter. So this is gonna be perfect just to chuck on all the time. And then the last thing I got from my parents is a gilet, like a super long gilet. This was from, I'm not actually sure where this is from. Hold on. This is from Brave Soul, but I think it was from ASOS. And yeah, it's just got a hood, it's brown. It's a gilet, but it's like super, super long. It's one of those like really long coat ones. And I don't have anything like this. Um, and I just thought it'd be lovely for the winter. My mum got herself one as well. And we bought this like a month ago, but she's wrapped it up for my birthday. And so yeah, I think this is gonna be super, super nice in the winter with like my docks and a hoodie. Yeah, it's just gonna be great. But yeah, that reminds me, I haven't got them here now, but as you've seen in my video, I did get a pair of docks for my birthday as well from my mum. I am selling my old docks, so, they're not gonna be like as expensive because my docs, I've had them like seven years, but they're still so perfect. So I'm hoping to get about 80 pounds for those, 70 pounds, something like that. 
so then my new docks will only be like 60 70 pounds have I worked that out right I'm not sure okay, and now moving on to gifts from my friends so as you've seen my best friend got me a ticket to go see the girls bathroom in February I'm so beyond excited for that but I think I've already spoke to you about that and then she also got me my favorite Gillian chocolates I love these so so much <laughs> From my other friends, she got me a photo frame um, with photos in from when we went to Iceland and when we went to Pride, like all special, special memories. And it's just so lovely, like I can literally feel myself welling up now. Um, oh, Iceland is just so special to me for a very deep reason, to be honest. And I just, yeah. It's a beautiful, beautiful present. And then she also got me some Haribo sweets, love, and a chocolate orange. Oh, I've just got so much chocolate and I've also got my massive cake, Biscoff and white chocolate cake. Are you joking? That is just perfect. And my sister just knows me so well, like that cake I'm literally gonna be eating for the rest of my life, it's so big. Then. My other friend, bless her heart, she got her hands on the Trigwell Cosmetics powder puffs. Look at this packaging, isn't it beautiful? So it's the big sponge and then the mini puff. And oh my God, let me show you. They are so, so soft. I can't wait to use these. And I just can't believe she managed to get her hands on them, bless her. She said it was so hard to get, but they're like so, so soft. I can't wait to use these. My makeup is gonna be like so airbrushed. <sighs> I just can't believe how much I've been spoiled. Like I, I feel, I just, I can't even believe that this is me saying this, looking at all of this. Like people have actually spent their time, effort and money on me. Why? Why have you done that? <sighs> it's just, it's too much. I can't cope with the kindness. I really can't cope with the kindness. My other friend, these were the friends that I went out with on the Saturday, by the way, that got me gifts. And this is what she got me, a cherry blossom gin liqueur. I have never, ever tried cherry gin, but I can imagine it's gonna taste lovely. So yeah, this is what my other friend got me and I love it. The bottle is so nice. I don't know if you can see like all of the, oh, quick ASMR for you. <laughs> I'm beyond, beyond grateful for every single little thing, the messages, the cards, the gifts. It's been, it's been so much and my heart feels just so fucking full. I'm just so grateful and I can't thank everybody enough for making this birthday so special. That is it for this birthday vlog. I really hope you've enjoyed and if you have, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye.